Here are my tips on how to look clean. Tip one, simple outfit. Blue jeans and a white top will always do the trick. Remember, it's classic, not basic. Next category, hair. Always make sure, no matter what type of hair that you have, that it's clean and make sure you have no flyaways. I like to take a comb with some hairspray and put them down like so. Next is makeup. We want dewy skin, a bold eye, and a nice glossy lip. On my lips today, I'm wearing this Lancome Juicy Two, which are my favorite. The last tip, which is extremely important, is smell. To ensure that you smell good all day, put the perfume on these points and especially your hair. This will make it last all day. Those are my tips on how to look clean. Good luck. Mwah. Love you. Okay, things you need if you want to look fresh and just clean all the time. People always say that I look clean and that's the best compliment of all lifetime. So I'm about to put you on. Number one is a good skincare routine. You guys have seen mine already, it's on my page, but a good skincare routine that's gonna leave your skin looking plump and gorge. Honorable mentions from my skincare routine. <laughs> this is the last step of your skincare routine, the sunscreen. This is the Hawaiian Tropic Weightless um, Silk Hydration one. You guys already know, this is, the, this is that girl. Before that though, I love the Rode Barrier Restore Cream. It's wet. <laughs> and then the Nivea Cream as well. Either one of these is gonna give you like such a flawless, like plump face along with this. It is a fire eyelash curler. My best friend Natalie actually gave me this one. I think she just got it at TJ Maxx, but this has turned into my favorite eyelash curler. Having curled eyelashes and clean skin and like fluffed up brows is truly, truly like your best bet. It's your best bet, girl. It's clear, your eyelashes are curled, now you need a fire lip balm. This one is the peptide lip treatment. I've talked about this before, it's stunning. I'm gonna put it on right now. I love this, it's honestly like almost gone because I've been using the crap out of it. But this is stunning because it leaves your lips looking so glossy. You have a glossy lip, clean face, eyelashes curled, you can't beat that just gonna make you feel and look so fresh and hydrated and just oh, a glowing goddess walking down the street. Next thing you need is a hydrating lotion. I prefer the Eucerin one. This one is Lubriderm. Anything super rich, talked about this before, but anything super rich is gonna get you where you need to be because your skin's gonna be so hydrated and supple. I love this deodorant. Honestly, you guys, I'm not sponsored by them. I know it's kind of seeming like that, but I swear on everything I'm not. This brand is the ultimate like clean, fresh brand. The scents are unreal. This one is, what is this? Santal Bloom. It's like the most stunning deodorant ever. It's a natural deodorant and it actually lasts. I tested this out another, a day where it was like 85 degrees outside. Lasts so well. I, I kept smelling myself and I'm like, I still smell so good, like so good. Another smell good step is obviously this. I mentioned it before, but this one, it smells so good and it's really hydrating, so can't beat that. Lastly, hair slicked back, little hoops, fresh face, everything just fresh, glowy. You don't even need any makeup. The clean girl look on not so clear skin. Just going in with some vitamin C. Gonna moisturize the skin with the Inky List Omega Water Cream. And then I'm gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury Invisible Primer SPF. Now that we have this glowy base, we can go in with some makeup. So I'm just using some brow gel to brush out my crazy brows. Gonna go in with the Trini London Tinted Serum. And I'm just gonna take some of this on my finger and dot it kind of over my face and then I'm going to simply take my finger to pat this out super lightly over the skin. This will even out a bit of that redness without really covering all my skin up like you're still gonna really see everything underneath. And then where I want a little more extra coverage I'm gonna take the e.l.f. hydrating camo concealer in the shade fair warm and use my finger with this as well but just to get more concentrated coverage. I want to add some blush so I'm gonna take this one from Euphoria, pat it on the cheeks and then use my finger to tap that out. Going in with one of my faves, the Charlotte Tilbury bronzer to add some color back to my skin. Very, very lightly setting just the center of the face. I'm gonna add a light coat of mascara. This is the L'Oreal X Fiber. I really like this one. And then just gonna very slightly wing out the eyes with a little eyeshadow and kind of blend it right into the lashes. I'm gonna take Merit Lip Oil in the shade Sangria. 
just to add a little bit of color to the lips. Set that all down with the Sephora setting spray. Here is the finished look. And just remember, you do not need clear skin to achieve this clean girl look. And scarring, acne, and texture is all normal. Just remember that makeup is not supposed to always look super flawless how you see it online. Remember to tell yourself something you love about your skin today. I love you guys all so much, and I hope you have a great one. Hi friends, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking about how to look clean and how to be clean. So I recently made a video on how to smell good all day and you guys really like that video. So this is how I stay clean and how I stay looking clean. The first thing I do is I wash my bed sheets like once a week, including my pillowcases and my duvet cover. What you sleep in throughout the day, especially if you don't shower in the morning, is going to kind of affect how you look and how you feel and how you present yourself throughout the day. So I believe that sleeping in clean sheets is really important. The towel that I use to dry myself off of after the shower, I exchange every two days. I used to use a new towel every single time, but that's a lot of laundry. And so I didn't want to do that anymore, but I think every two days is totally acceptable. I find that after I shower and I freshly clean myself, I want to dry myself off with something that's also clean. And in the shower, I always wash my body from top to bottom and I wash like my toes and my feet and I actually scrub soap on my legs and everywhere and even up behind my ears and behind my neck. Getting into those like meticulous places you wouldn't really think of is a great way to stay really clean. Another thing I do to be clean is to never wear the same pair of socks or underwear two days in a row. Bras, shirts, and pants I think you can get away with depending what you did that day and how sweaty you were maybe but everything else I think you should definitely wear new every day. Oral hygiene is really important for me to staying clean and looking clean. So I brush twice a day, mouthwash, I don't floss, but my toothbrush is pretty good. So I don't feel like I need to, but my dentist probably will say otherwise. And if you want your teeth to appear more white, I recommend using uh, 3D whitening strips or like Crest whitening strips. I use the off-brand ones because they are way cheaper. Clipping your toenails consistently and making sure your toes look good. I mean, even though no one's going to see it, I feel like it just like makes me feel cleaner. And then also I always like to have my nails done, but even just cutting them or having like a simple clear polish is a great way to like keep them clean. Uh, washing your hair consistently or like enough. I've, obviously every hair type is different. I wash my hair twice a week and then the rest of the time I just use dry shampoo and a little bit of hair oil at the ends to like kind of freshen it up. Um, and making sure your hair is brushed and not naughty, and yeah. I also think a little bit of light makeup can make you look really clean. I believe that if my brows, my lashes, my lips, and my cheeks are done, then I'm good. So just a little bit of brow gel, mascara, blush, and a gloss, and I like feel so much cleaner. And yeah, that's about all I do. I hope this helps. I love you all. Bye! Just for nothing.